Hi, welcome back to another video about Edge Spy. So as you could see in this video, we will know how to we will start to um, simulate a diet. I want to search for a pen. We want to see the simulate the diet when the diet is in a simple circuit. Uh, before doing anything, I want to share my opinion about the component defined in Edge Spy software. So for example, if we want to define a resistor in edge device. Just in my opinion, we need to have a symbol, and then we need to define a value for the symbol. After we define the symbol and the value for the symbol, then we will definitely finish defining the resistor in edge device. Similarly, for symbol components like capacitor or inductor. They need only a symbol and the constant value, or let's say the value for the component. However, in the diet, it will be a little bit more complicated. But the concept is the same. The diet needs a symbol and its characteristic. However, the diet characteristic is more than just a value. The diet characteristics can have many value, and each value has their own function for example it could have the resistance when the diode is on or what is the forward voltage drop on the diode and the reverse voltage drop on the diode etc so there are many characteristics of a diode more than just one value and in order to support us to do so Spice has the dot model command with this dot model command we can specify a very complex characteristic for our diet. Now let's jump in, in the simulation. So this is the circuit I opened in Edispice. If you want to know how to draw a circuit with shortcuts, please refer to my some old video. I put it in the comment section. Check it out if you are interested in it. Now let's do it. Here we got the circuit but containing only symbols, none of them is defined totally. Let's put the value for our voltage. In order to do that, control right click on the voltage symbol and then in the value. In the value. Um now we just can put the the name. So let's right click only in the symbol. Right right click and then choose advanced. We want to specify the input voltage as a sine wave. DC offset is 0, amplitude is 2, and frequency is 1 kHz. OK. So now our input voltage is defined totally with a symbol and its value. For the resistor, we have a symbol. Let's define the value. Right click, and here you can define 1 kilo ohm. Or you can control right click on the symbol and put 1 kilo ohm in the value row and click OK. So voltage is done, resistor is done, but the diode is not yet because we need to specify the characteristic for the diode. And before define any uh, characteristic for the diode, let's uh, jump into a little bit of concept of the diode characteristic. So here you could see the voltage and current of a diode. In realistic case, it will look like how it looks like this. However, for easier analysis, we will have a very straightforward model, which is when the voltage drop on the diode is, let's say, in this case, we idealize it as zero, then the diode will start to be conductive. It means the diode start to conduct a current going in the forward direction. Forward direction, as you could see, this arrow pointing in the forward direction. If you go opposite to the arrow pointing direction, we are going in the reverse direction. In this case, we only care about the forward direction in the pointing direction of the arrow. So if the voltage drop on this diode in the forward direction, in this direction, is zero according to the idealized 
characteristic of the diet, then the diet can let a current with infinitely big value going through it. However, when you put the diet into a defined circuit, then the current going through the current going through the diet here is very small. Uh, not very small, but it is constrained with a value. So now I think the characteristic part of the characteristic of the diet are explained. So let's modify or specify them. Right click in the schematic to draft and to spice directive and then you put dot model. And next is the name of our diet. How could we know what is the name value of our diet? Control right click on the symbol and here is the value and the name is the D. We can change it into like for example uh, diet value. Okay. And then we choose Spice Directive. Either you did like I did previously or you could choose here. Dot op, you can open Spice Directive very quickly. And then type dot model. Next is the name of the value of our diet, which is diet value. Next is the type. What is the type? Because uh, we have a diet, so the type is D. And then in this uh, in this space, we will specify the characteristics of the diet in order to make our diet as an ideal diet. As you could see, the IV characteristic of an ideal diet is of straight, a very straight, totally off straight line, doesn't have any slope. As a result, the resistance when the diet conducting when the diet is on is equal to zero. And you could see here when the diet status conduct it means the forward voltage drop on the diet is zero. It cannot go over zero because the diet can withstand infinitely big current. That's why when the diet starts to conduct in conducting whatever value of the current, the voltage drop in the forward direction of the diet is always always zero. So we need to specify the forward voltage is zero. Now we are done for defining our ideal diet. Let's simulate stop time. I want to see five periods of the sine wave. So it will be 5 millisecond and click OK. Cannot define defi value. OK. OK. Why? Let's turn it off because here you see my name is type value but the name of the value I put here is not exactly the same. So I need to fix it. So now I think it's fine because the name here diet value is the same name with the diet value I defined for my diet. So let's run. So no error appears anymore. So let's measure. This is our input voltage and let's see our voltage drop in the forward direction of the diet. So this is the voltage drop on the diet. Okay, I think this is long enough video and I I think I will make a part two of the video where I will explain this graph and do another example in defining another type of diet, also an ideal diet but a little bit different. If you find that the video is helpful, please give me a like or subscribe and see you in the part two. Thank you so much for watching.